Factsverse presents 20 Photos That Take a Second to Sink In Before the Real Situation Becomes Clear People take pictures to remember these special moments in life. We want something to look back on so that we can relive those special memories of the past. Many photos are just, well, your typical picture. Other photos, though, thanks to the lighting, the angle, or the subject in general, it can make you do a double take. And we have 20 photos that actually take a second to sink in before the real situation becomes clear. Most fathers are pretty protective of their daughters. They always want to be close by, just in case their little girl needs them. Now, upon first glance, it appears that this father is so overprotective, he managed to stretch his arm 10 feet just to let his little girl know that he's there for her. Well, if you look a little closer at the photo, though, you will see that it's only the other girl's hand wrapped around the other woman's shoulder. The angle of the camera fools everybody, though. The guy in this photo has one of the strangest haircuts imaginable. It looks like a giant tennis ball. Makes you wonder what he said to his barber when he walked into the shop. Did he say, please make me look like a green tennis ball? Is this haircut called the Wimbledon? If not, it should be. Maybe he had tickets to Wimbledon and he just wanted to look the part? Kinda makes you wonder. Now, at first glance, this looks like a picture of a family sitting together enjoying a takeout meal. When you look in the reflection of the window, though, things get a bit creepy. It seems like the family is being watched by somebody outside. Is it a spirit? Is it a peeping Tom? Nope, it's Grandma sitting on the couch in the other room, and her reflection appears in the window. Hey, at least we know the family is safe. This firefighter went to the supermarket and he purchased dozens and dozens of bottled waters. What, did he Did he fail firefighting school? Is he not allowed to use the hose anymore? So he's looking for some other way to help? Maybe he knows something everybody in the store doesn't. Perhaps there's some major disaster about to happen and he knows. That would explain the water and the fact that he's already in full gear. Maybe he's just buying water for the fire station, but then why did he have to wear his full gear when going out shopping, hmm? Now, at first glance, it looks like this guy is wearing a pair of fishnet stockings with his cut-off jeans, which right then and there is a fashion faux pas. He also seems to be pretty proud of it for some stupid reason. But then you look closer and you realize it's not fishnet stockings at all. It's just the shadow of the chair in front of him on his legs. The shadow's perfect, though. I mean, it even looks like there are elastics on the top holding them up. This picture's great. Most all people have at least one mole on their body, and they try to hide it. Moles are unsightly, and some are even gross. The man in this picture was given lemons, so he decided to make lemonade. He realized that he was losing his hair, and he decided to shave it, but then that made his mole become very obvious. Well, rather than wearing a hat or walking around with a receding hairline, this guy decided to go to a tattoo artist. He had Michael Jordan tattooed on his head and the mole became the basketball. He turned something ugly into something actually kind of cool. Who doesn't love cats? I mean, they're adorable, they're furry, most of them are very lovable. Well, the boy in this photo, he decided to throw a party for his kitties, and he is the entertainment. Not only does he play the accordion, but he also plays the keyboards. And he has cats on hand, dancing to his music. You know, it's not very often that you find two cats who know how to dance. They seem to be having a great time, and they love having their photo taken, too, apparently. Dogs love to go for rides. I mean, there's no question about that. When their owner runs errands, the dogs always want to go with them. The dog in this photo loves taking rides, too, but his owner is not very responsible about it. I mean, dogs do not belong on motorcycles, even if they're wearing a pretty pink helmet. Uh, no. What makes this photo even more disturbing is the rider is wearing a helmet, the dog's wearing a helmet, but the girlfriend on the back isn't? <laughs> well, you can see where this guy's priorities are. His safety and his dog's safety, that's his number one priority. Who cares if the girlfriend gets a concussion? And if this girlfriend ends up with a severe head injury or worse, I guess it's no big deal to this guy. Yeah, as long as he and his dog are safe, he's fine. I'm thinking this girl might want to rethink her relationship. Like, right now, before he takes off.
Okay, there are a few things that you should never do when you're on the toilet. One of them is eating. I mean, there are so many germs and bacteria all over the bathroom, especially a public restroom. Food should never be taken in there, let alone into the stall with you. Ugh. And what makes this even worse is that his box of donuts is on the floor and it's open. That, that Okay, uh, that's just disgusting. I mean, and every time he puts one of these donuts in his mouth, he's actually putting himself at a significant risk of getting sick. All right, I'm, I'm a fan of multitasking and I'm a fan of donuts, but uh, no, this is just going too far. No. Most people try not to think too much about death because, well, it's a frightening thought. Nobody wants to leave this world and everyone and everything they love behind. That's part of the reason why some people get uneasy when it comes to seeing a hearse. It's a reminder that one day you will have to have a hearse too. Being behind this particular hearse is even more unsettling. The license plate reads, You Are Next. Is this the universe trying to tell the driver taking the photo that they are next to die? Or is it the funeral home's idea of a funny joke? Either way, this sends chills down the spine. Most women like to wear their hair up when they go to the beach. It keeps the hair out of their face when they're lying in the sun or swimming. The girl in this photo looks like she wore her hair in a high bun on top of her head. Take a closer look, though. You'll see that that's not a bun at all. That's a man's head standing behind her. The person who took the photo managed to get just the right angle at just the right moment to make it look like a hair bun. The person who lives here saw the ceiling fan and obviously wanted to do something different with it. I mean, he didn't want an ordinary ceiling fan that you'd see in every other house, so uh, he drew a helicopter upside down. When the fan's running, of course, it looks like the helicopter's falling from the sky. Pretty clever. And kind of scary if you were to suddenly wake up and see that. Now, at first glance, it looks like this woman has had a very unfortunate accident and lost her hand, and maybe your doctors wanted to perform some groundbreaking surgery and they transplanted a foot on her hand to make her life easier. That's what it looks like. I mean, really, a foot, I guess, is better than having nothing. But that's not the case. Not to worry. The woman just happened to lean down at just the right time when the camera was at the right angle, and it looks pretty great. Okay, there are just so many things wrong with this photo. I mean, cattle roping is a real sport, and people love it. A lot of people work for years to excel at cattle roping. It's not the cattle roping that's odd, though. It's the fact that Tinky Winky, one of the Teletubbies, is the one doing the roping. Hey, Teletubbies are famous for a lot of things, but cattle roping is not one of them. At least not yet. Many people make a living selling hot dogs. Some sell them on the street from a cart. Some sell hot dogs at sporting events and concerts. This guy sells hot dogs, but he couldn't handle the competition on the streets or at the events, so he decided to start selling them at a very underserved market. Boating people. People out on the water. Hey, they get hungry too, and it's not safe to grill on a boat, so this guy is a hero to the boaters on the water. His boat is an excellent form of advertisement too. Have no fear, Water Wiener Man is here. Now, at first glance, this looks like a typical store. They have a deli, which is signified by the pig. They have a butcher, signified with a cow. They have a fish market, signified by, of course, a fish. And it's the catering and provisions part that is kind of the head-scratcher. They used a dinosaur to signify catering and provisions? Is the store owner waiting for the dinosaurs to take over? Has he stocked up on raptor repellent and dinosaur darts? When you first buy new scented shampoo, everybody wants to smell it. Well, the girl in this photo took things a bit too far. Her friend does seem to really like the smell, though. While this picture looks strange, the little girl in the back appears to be holding an older girl who has no torso. She's just a chest and legs. Well, if you look closer, you see the older girl's holding the younger girl on her back, but the picture is perfectly timed. The Major League is not discriminating. They allow men of all races and sexual orientations to play. And according to this article, they're also letting amphibians play in the Majors. 
The article was talking about Pat Vendit, the ambidextrous pitcher for the Oakland Athletics, and the person in charge of proofreading apparently just got it wrong. The writer and the editor probably got into a lot of trouble for this one. There's a big difference between ambidextrous and amphibious. The guy in this photo felt uncomfortable lying out in his Speedo like the guys beside him, so and well, instead of wearing a t-shirt and a pair of shorts like some normal person, he went in a completely different direction. He covered himself from head to toe with post-it notes. Hey, maybe he takes sun protection very seriously. A bottle of sunscreen? It might have worked just as well, but it wouldn't nearly as been as photogenic. Subscribe for more.